you can see here where it punched through You can see right there where it punched through to the uh, primary and it looks good back here so I'm gonna use some of this on it uh, ultra gray and it's uh, low odor and non corrosive and it's sensor safe so it doesn't have the acid and it's OEM for a Toyota, Nissan, Honda, Acura, a Mitsubishi, and Hyundai. And that's really all that's important. Okay, we are powering up. And there's a few things I want to check. It's still wet. I just put it back, but I don't think it's conductive when it's wet. 100 million people in the U.S. today over 50 years old. Products that just don't work. You are not alone. Today, okay. Billion people worldwide I am going to touch to the cap onto the horizontal tube and we'll see what happens. Huh. I smell Corona big time. I would say we're good. Wow. You want to see that with the lights off? You see why that has the potential to um, burn right through that insulation there. Okay, I'm really interested in the cathode current. I don't really want to be much over 200. Now you can hear the high voltage just came up. 220 is okay. Uh, if it was way out of whack, I would say something, you know, some of those turns in the primary shorted together. It's a little on the high side. But we have a picture. I have children down to a very young age and I want to be active with them as long as I can. It's allowed me to keep up with them and experience good things. That's thanks to Omega, so no doubt. The silicone is still wet. But as you can see with that arcing, the uh, I might adjust this. This is a little bit high. See if I can lower that. It should be around 215, 220. Before I do that, I think I might have found the problem that caused most of this. I'm running this thing. I Somehow it ended up plugged into the high output on the ISOTAP. And I usually run it on the low, lower voltage. I usually try and run them around 115. Let me see what it measures. Okay, yeah, I measured my line voltage and I was putting 123 into the television and I had, what, 200 and... Uh, 28 milliamps so I dropped it down to the right tap down to 115 volts and I got 213 milliamp so I'm going to tweak Let's see if I can smoke myself here tweak on this coil mm, I dropped it down a little bit A rating with a better business bureau and if you mention best deals, you'll get a free stainless steel sink valued at $300. I can't even imagine the backsplash I had before that I had picked because this is so pretty. Like I say, every time I come in here, I, I smile. So everything, the quality is beautiful. And so when I finally decided on three-day flooring, then of course I have to tell everybody else that they have to use three-day flooring. Start your today. No shit, lady. Tell us something we don't know.
information on the businesses that you've seen featured on our show, go to our website, Best Deal TV Show. Oh. You are familiar with these. Did you know that over 50 billion water bottles are consumed each year at a cost of $1 to $5 per bottle? That really adds up to some real money, not to mention how many end up in our landfill. You know what, lady? The bottles are not consumed. The bottles are a transport device. The water is consumed. I a water purification system. I got tired of going to the store endlessly, buying case after case of bottled water. And we've all heard of the controversy surrounded drinking water from plastic containers. Seven years later, over a thousand prototypes, the Remington Pure water purification system gives you the purest water at your fingertips in the convenience of your own home. Sure it does. There are so many water purification systems out there. But what would I do without my bisphenol A? People who purchase water purification systems in the past. All right, well, we're looking good here. And cathode currents 212. That's uh, more than acceptable for this. And um, the silicone is still wet, so I'm just going to let it dry. Well, I'm going to use it, let it bake. Don't we all? Uh, by the way, this is. Um, a cathode current oh, test adapter socket. Some people will know what it is, some won't. They make these for um, 6JE6, uh, the RCA tube, and they make it for the Zenith, which is the 6JS6, um, which co also covers the 6LR6 and the 6LB6 and a whole bunch of them. Then they make another one that covers the 6, and I'm probably going to screw this up, but the 6DQ6 and 6BQ6. See, 6BQ5 is the audio one, so 6BQ6, which also covers 6V6, 6 L6, 6F6, all those audio tubes. So these are kind of a nice thing to have to, um, if you work on a lot of these. Cathode current is very important.